Hi, it's me again with Corel Raw Tips and Tricks. And just earlier today, I made a video on how to make the artistic media tool even, but how do you make the slope even on both sides? If we put the plus key on the keyboard and turn the plus one yellow and we mirror it both ways, well, we can mirror it that way and you can see automatically that it's equal. But if we mirror it the other way, it'll actually be on top of the other one. So it's a perfect match. How do I do that? I did it with the three point curve line. Let me zoom in a little bit. Take the three point curve and you could almost use any tool, but the three point curve is only gonna have two nodes. Let's make it a little bit, a little bit thicker than that or a little bit more of a curve and you could put the curve anywhere I'm making this thing pretty big. So you've got that now. Control D and make a duplicate of it. Yep, I want to make sure I did. And then mirror it both ways. And then take, when you get that four point cross, have it go right to that node. Now, the artistic media tool won't work yet because that node needs to be joined so we're going to grab that with the shape tool and then grab the other side and then grab both of them, go up to windows, dockers, join curves. I already had it open. So I know I got to open it again and I've got mine point set on one point one, which will work. So now that's a, that's a single line in the, in the artistic media tool will work, but actually to give you a smoother trend, I'm going to just hit the delete key. Now it changed our pattern a little bit. But if you're looking for something perfect, this is perfect. And you could have used it with the node. Now we're going to get our artistic media tool and touch the pencil to the item and just change it like I did earlier in the video. Uh, you have to change it one number or the other. And let's make this like two inches. And this is a perfect uh, equal in every direction. Control D and make a duplicate. I like, before we do that, I'm going to take this artistic media part. I'm going to left click, right click, go up to object. I've got to select it all. Go up to object and break the artistic media part. And then you can get rid of that line. And just to kind of prove that we're equal, control, well, let's make it black. Let's make it black. And then control D and make a duplicate of it, make it yellow and then mirror it both directions, it is back. And when you mirror something, it's flipping it over. This here alone shows you that it's perfect because the spaces between the two dots are equal. We could even measure that. Parallel dimension tool from that node to that node is 2.73. Parallel dimension tool, I'm gonna have to zoom in. 2.73, so it's equal. And you could, you know, go on forever with this. And, uh, you know, if you needed something equal and uh, blended like that, or not blended, but where you could do things like this, because this would be the start of something. Anyway, I hope that answered their question, and thank you for watching.